Gold has seen a massive drop with the inflation data coming in. The hot inflation data has caused gold to drop below 2000 levels, the critical support levels. Now it is trading at 1993 levels. So what to expect today? How to profit trading gold? Is it going to crash more or there is a possibility of a rise? What is going to be our strategy for the day? We will see with the help of charts and indicators. If you are new to the channel, subscribe and press the bell icon to get the latest updates. Next update will be released before the US session and do like, share and comment as well. Let's start first to look into early charts. And yes, if you have not joined the channel memberships, join the membership channel memberships and enjoy the benefits. Let's start first. If you look at the early charts, it is consolidating right now with the support at uh, 1990 levels. 1990, 1989 is a good support level. And on the upside, we can find out it is falling. Uh, it is not willing to break beyond 1995. Now, once it stays, because see, after consolidation, obviously a little retracement cannot be denied. How far it can retrace? possibility for it to move towards 2000 2005 zone is there which is going to be a critical resistance. yes prices are trading with little divergence from the moving average it can try to converge towards this the stock is rising MACD has seen a sharp fall it is trying to converge crossover for a rise rsi is also oversold and hence a little retracement cannot be denied coming to two hour charts similar observation here and you can see rise retracement rise retracement then uh drop retracement and the sharp drop has come here now it is trying to stabilize at the current levels possibility for it to move towards 2000 2005 exist but it is going to be slower we have seen that the stock is rising from the oversold magd is still trading with divergence and bearishness a possibility of conversion and crossover exist this was the last fall when it has crossed over on the sell side and has reversed since then similar possibility exists but right now it is not willing to give the same formation rsi is oversold coming to three hour charts on the three hour chart see this could be a reversal signal if and only if gold trades above 1995-96 zone you can consider that this is a reversal sign and then the prices might move towards uh, 2000 and 2005 levels here prices are trading with too much of divergence from the 20 period moving average either it is going to consolidate here in this zone wait for the moving average to climb down and then retrace towards these levels Thus, it is going to be fewer more candles for it to move towards that zone. Stochastic oversold, MACD is bearish, RSI is oversold here. Coming to 4 hours, similar observation, this could be a reversal sign. But yes, it has to break beyond 1995 zone in order to confirm further rise. And then it could continue with the retracement here. Moving averages are definitely trading with divergence and bearishness. It will wait for the moving average to climb down and then it will try to move up. Stochastic oversold, MACD is divergent and bearish, RSI is oversold. Coming to daily charts. Before we look into daily charts, if you want to learn this art of trading, be a part of my 29th mentorship batch commencing in a couple of weeks, where you can learn the tools and strategies with the help of which you can definitely identify profitable trades and profitable trades. Reach out to me. And yes, if you just want to trade as per the signals, join my signals channel on Telegram. Again, if for any queries, you can write an email or ping me on Telegram. All the details are shared in the channel and video description. Also, if you have not joined the platform forexonda.com, be a part of it where besides all the market information, you also get the option to schedule a call with me if you need any consultation or guidance or you want me to make a prediction. Now coming to daily charts, yes, moving average is crossing over here on the daily charts after a long time, uh, almost it is after three months, moving averages are crossing on the sell side. Now see, this was a buy crossover and the sell crossover here was somewhere in August. So almost after six months, it is crossing for a selling entry. Thus prices might uh, trade bearish in the near term. That is what we can infer from this. But for the day, see the candle is outside Bollinger Bands. There's a possible little retracement on the upside can be expected. Uh, 2000, 2005 levels are possible to achieve. But remember this fact. See, it has to break past more than half the size of this candle. Thus it has to stay about 2010 level where you can say that it is reversing the data and the candles uh, do not suggest that it is going to break past 2010 but yes if it does certainly more bullishness may prefer on the downside at the same time you can sell here at 1988 levels below which you can look forward to see one sharper bearish candle if it draws below 88 this is the first support zone at around 78 levels and then 72 levels so 1972 1972 72.5 is the stronger support here for gold on the downside below which certainly it is going to trade bearish in the near term the stock i think here is oversold magd is divergent and bearish rsi is flatted but i'm considering this i will recommend you to buy here at 2000 1995 96 levels expect it to move 
closer towards 2000 and then 2005 levels 1997-2000 is the zone which is going to be a resistance zone and then 2005 is an achievable level as well only and only if gold trades about 2010 you can consider this for a reversal else prices are to be considered as bearish where it can try to achieve lower highs lower lows thus lower lows means uh, below 1989-88 levels you can initiate a selling entry here below 1988 we can look forward to 1984 levels and then below 1984 this time 1978 and 1972.5 these are going to be the two support take your positions accordingly like share subscribe and comment join my mentorship batch webinar series signal channel reach out to me for any of your queries my telegram and email ids are mentioned in the channel and video description thank you very much have a great profitable trading day ahead see you again before the us session update thank you